they use the term goodwill, which uh, yeah, like I guess reputation. Like, will people uh, sacrifice a few more pennies or a few more dollars just to get that brand? Mm -hmm. Yeah, goodwill would be uh, things that you can't really measure about. You know, the company's reputation and things like that. You can't really put a figure on that or a value or a number. You know to compare it accurately right, against right. another company. So that kind of, you just, it's more subjective mm -hmm. and how you kind of just have to think about it on your own, how valuable this company is. Right. Well, I know there are like a matrix that talk about, they measure the best, uh, best brand. Mm -hmm. like Forbes or somebody comes out with that. Bloomberg, I don't know, like one, one of those big companies comes out with a, they rank the ranking of uh, most reputable companies. Yeah. So that would be a source of outside perspective, I guess. Yeah, this could be also economic goodwill. Yeah. You know, where they take those factors in, but maybe it's just a few people that right. have right. a decision, these critics. That, right, right. You know, Good point. So. And, and, that, there, uh, in that same section, it talks about the commodities issue, which you were talking about earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, and mentioned, you know, even computers can become commodities, like, in, the commodity like, I, I'm yeah. not sure that term you, you yeah. said. Yeah, because when, when you look at a computer today, you probably compare memory, you compare price, you compare size, you know, these kinds of things. Right, it doesn't matter the company the speed. Needs. Yeah, and you pick the one that fits your criteria the best, you know, so. Gotcha. So it doesn't really matter from one brand to the next for some people. But on the other hand, you have Apple. Mm -hmm. And some people, like I love using Apple products, well, Apple computers, you know? And I've just found that they're much more friendly for me to use. I still use PCs, but I love Apples. Yeah, you know? I've gotten used to them as well. Yeah. Even, even the... Uh their products are really, uh, like if you look right now, you know, it's May 2016, uh, there's a lot of different computers that are really delayed. They need a new version, like desperately. It's mm -hmm. been way too long. And yet still, people are loyal to the brand. Uh, I, I think they're kind of pushing it to limits, but uh, yeah. it, you know, people are still holding on to it. And this is a thing... You probably have people with Apple tattooed on their arms. <laughs> yeah, right, right, right. And they have stickers Shirts, all over the place. Stickers, yeah. And when you watch uh, movies, at least in America, it seems like every computer that's in a movie has the Apple logo in it because I guess, you know, Apple provides free computers to get the advertising or yeah. they pay to have the Apple computer put in there. So they get this brand identity all over the place. 